never ever 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 Taurus I warn you never ever ever unless you have it done pack or you came to the island before try to speak like an islander it's really really insulting because people already think that everybody from the Caribbean from Jamaica don't try to speak like an islander unless you think you get it done pack or you have family down here example let's say me and three of my girl them walking down Main Street and we talking and Taurus these is first time tourists to the Virgin Islands and they come up to us like oh my god you guys I love your accent so we like thank you thank you thank you where are you guys from she's gonna be like yeah man I'm from Illinois man so where are they going man is either we gonna laugh or we gonna beat the shit out of you in the United States usually when you drive in you drive on the right side of the road to go but down in the Virgin Islands, you keep left. So just remember, if you have a rental car down here, you keep to the left. The right lane is for the oncoming. The left lane is for your going, okay? Good. I cannot stand to see tourists walk around this damn island with their bikini or their shorts, their ass hanging out. Like the entire island is a beach. Third thing, the island is not a beach. Wear normal clothes. Next thing. This is not Survivor Man. This island has internet, cars, running water, computers, and houses please people stop asking the stupid questions oh my god how am i gonna get around the island oh my god do you guys have internet oh my god do you have computers oh my god oh my god google please it's not hard our local language is english i don't know if you find it hard to understand but if you can't understand it then hey we can't some people really cannot help you because they can't yank we call speaking american dialects yank some people can't do that so if you can't understand whoa hmm. You suck. The accent, our accent is better known as Virgin Islands Real. Taurus, please, when you come down here to the Virgin Islands, do not take pictures of us standing up on the side of the road waiting for a local safari to go to where we need to go. This is not Safari Man or this is not Africa where you're taking pictures of zebras and lions and stuff. We look like animals? No. It really annoys me, especially like when I'm in a bad mood. Safari's fast to make click, 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 click. <laughs> What the hell? I'm not... Shit. On a positive note, enjoy what our island has to offer you. We have lovely beaches, lovely hotels, lovely amenities for you to play with on the beach. So please enjoy it. Why? Because your ass can afford it. I've heard about some people coming here to the island. They're in the hotel. They call the front desk and they're like, Could you please stop? Make it stop raining today. The fuck is that person? God? People. Be realistic with the weather. Yes, forest advertisements show you sun and clear skies and sexy water. There's some days it will rain. Don't cry about it. Enjoy it while, while you're here. Just enjoy the nature. Enjoy what God has to offer you. Power goes out from time to time. Just be aware of that. Some of you are like so materialistic that if power goes out for a second, you'll like die. But trust me, you won't. If power goes out, just enjoy nature. Go outside. You won't die. Take a walk. You won't die. Just enjoy it. You won't get robbed. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. We're, we're friendly people. You need to know this as a tourist coming down here. If you don't want to catch the bus all the time, the taxi or the safari, for y'all, know this rule. When catching a local safari, which is the public transit of the island, the St. Thomas Island, know these four tips. From country to town, $2 a person. From town to country, $2 a person. From country to country, a dollar a person. From town to town, a dollar a person. I tell you this because if I go up to the safari man and ask him how much it is to get from this place to this place, he gonna see that I is tourist and be like five dollars a person. Cunning are you? Cunning are you? So glad you're watching my video so you could know. Cause I like you. The best time to vacation to come to the Virgin Islands is April, summer and Christmas. April because that's St. Thomas's, St. Thomas Island carnival time where there's the festivities and the costumes and the woo woo you can look that up on youtube summer because hey it's shit it's summer it's vacation island hello christmas because it's christmas and it's still warm down here it's the lowest it gets to is maybe 65 so beautiful lush weather for you to come and enjoy yourself it's live with activities most of that time like if you come during october it's not, nothing really going on because this island isn't really big on Halloween. To get around now, there's no street sign. We go by landmark. So we don't say, I live on Crenshaw Avenue or Brookman Street. We say, I live by the tall tree where part of Brookdown car is and the dolly outside, they hang it by the red car. That's how we know. 
we have landmarks, okay? Honestly, after a while, it sucks to live here. Resources are very limited. We're not so limited that we like a freaking third world country. Don't don't go there. Not a lot of food restaurants. It's just the major ones, McDonald's, Wendy's, KFC. Not a lot of clothes places, clothes, Rainbow and Marianne's and stuff. She first in time when an accident happened with a vehicle. Most likely it's because of a tourist. Driving stupid. Drive carefully. Remember, it's not like the States. You're not driving on the right side of the road. You're driving on the left. Drive carefully, but don't drive slow and stupid because if I'm on the road and you and you're a tourist, I go horn you, horn you, horn you till you drive right. Okay? Be respectful of the locals, please. I understand you're on vacation and you want to spend your money and you want to get crazy and wild and because the drinking age down here is 18. I understand that, but do not treat locals like they is your servant. I swear to God, locals will flip on you for that, and that is because you know why a lot of people don't like have a good experience with St. Thomas because I guess they was mean to a local or, or a smart ass to a local and the local just flipped on them. If you want to have an enjoyable vacation, be respectful to everybody, please, including us islanders that we accommodate you to enjoy your vacation. Tourists, have fun. I encourage you to come.